Whoa, what's going on, everybody? My name is D1, and I'm here because I wanted to speak on something that just happened recently to me. Um, I decided to contact this Instagram model. You know, she had over 200,000 followers, and I was on my Instagram one day, and um, her picture just popped up on, you know, the popular page with the... Um, when you're going to search for somebody, her picture just popped up on that page. And it was a picture of her with no shirt on. She didn't even have her face shown, no shirt on, just her two breasts and like chocolate syrup, you know, dripping down her breasts. That's all it was. So I clicked on it. And when I went through her page a little bit, I don't know, something just clicked to me and told me to hit her up. So I DM'd her and you know, I slid in her DMs and I was just asking her, you know, how she felt about portraying herself in such a way. Um, because I told her, I'm like, first and foremost, you're a beautiful woman. But how you feel about portraying yourself in such a way, um, especially knowing the influence you have over your followers? Because you have 200 and something thousand followers. I'm sure these are a lot of young women who look up to you. These are a lot of men who are looking at you and... You're only giving them one portrayal of how you are and who you are. And I told her I'm a public figure as well. Uh, I have a lot of followers. And it's something that I'm very aware of. I'm very conscious of the influence we have over the people who follow us. I feel like it's a blessing to actually have these followers. Like they've been entrusted to us, you know. So we start going back and forth um, on Instagram in her DMs. And it was a long back and forth. Uh, she proceeded to tell me that she has a master's degree in neuroscience and, you know, Instagram is nothing more than a stage where she performs. So she don't feel like um, her breasts should be taboo and her social media self and the person she really is are not the same. That's what she said. And I just feel like the fact that she's educated is a wonderful thing, but it's like, why are you not wanting to show people that side of you? You know, like, are you not taking it serious, the platform that you have and the influence you have? So I just wanted to see what you all's thoughts were on that because I just really, you know, I take that seriously. Like, I'm like, man, we don't have these followers for nothing. I told her in the DMs, I said, yo, we make money off of these followers. You know what I mean? Like, we get booked to go to clubs or to perform or to host or you know, there's a bunch of ways that we as celebrities monetize our followings. And I was just curious as to how she felt about that, especially after she told me how educated she is. I think she said she got like three master's degrees or something like that. Then she ended up saying that she has a fiance who doesn't care if she shows her breasts or poses topless online and all this stuff. And like I said, for me, it's just something that I think about every day. I'm thankful for the following that I do have, but I'm conscious of the responsibility I have to them. And I think that's how we need to be more as leaders, as entertainers, as celebrities. So I'm glad I hit her up. I'm, um, I didn't come at her, you know, in a disrespectful, rude manner or anything. And, you know, I just stopped responding after a while when I saw that this conversation would go on forever, you know, because she just, she started, you know, if I want to be nude in my free time, then F it, you know, um, you know, like if somebody chooses to live their life based on what they see on my IG, then that's their choice. And, you know, I just wanted to see what y'all thoughts were on this, you know, because there's a lot of um, Instagram models out there and, you know, people making real money off of this. But it's like, are they... Are they to be held to a standard where they should be conscious of the message they're sending out by just, you know, putting their body on display in such a manner, you know? So y'all let me know, all right? Once again, it's D1, holla at me. Three is up. Be real, be righteous, be relevant. You know what it is.